Good morning. So, I thought I'd uh, just do a quick video for you. And um, this is with regards to emails that are being sent out at the moment via the Royal Mint. Obviously, we're on the Royal Mint's website. Um, <laughs> I quite like the little buzzy bee that flies around with your cursor. So, uh, this is their announcement. Um, of a new 50p coin series um, which obviously as you can see is Winnie the Pooh a long time ago a bear of very little brain bumped down the stairs and into our world he loves honey Christopher Robin and all of his friends he is known for his hums tucking into smack crawls and for getting into all sorts of sticky spots we all know and love Winnie the Pooh. Beginning with Winnie the Pooh 50p coin, we're introducing a series of designs inspired by the classic stories of A.A. A. Milne. Welcome Winnie the Pooh and friends into your life as they appear for the first time on a UK 50p coin. And then I ask you to sign up for... Um, dates um you know and breaking news of exactly when we can expect to get this um i'm personally quite pleased about this um winnie the pooh story is actually based um just down the road from me um where were we we'll just go on to this one um it's based just on the outskirts of ashdown forest um where you can go to the bridge um and play <laughs> poo sticks so um those of you that know um it is basically where you drop sticks on one side of the river on water um and race them to the other side of the bridge and that is poo sticks um and as i say it's based in um, the Ashdown Forest <clears throat> near Hartfield, East Sussex. They say it dates back to at least 1907. And it's really nice because it's quite a way into the forest. Um, and along the way, there are little hidden gems, you know. <clears throat> um, there are little sort of... Um, fairy doors and that kind of thing built into the um into the trees and that so so it's quite an interesting um walk and and everything else down there you see plenty of the um pictures on there of it so it's a really nice walk and i'd strongly recommend it anybody that's local um to go down there so some of the characters that you can expect to find on these coming coins. Obviously Winnie the Pooh himself, Christopher Robin, uh, Piglet, Eeyore, Kanga, Roo, Tigger and the Rabbit. So yeah, um, I'm quite excited by this one. Um, I think it's going to be quite a, a nice series. Um, so, just briefly while we're on the, the location of it. For anybody that does visit um, Pooh Bridge in Hartfield, um, it's worth recommending. There is also a um, another cafe, corner shop, whatever you want to call it, um, gift shop called Pooh Corner. And it sells gift sweets as well as a um, menu out of the back. Um, what's interesting? Oh, uh, sorry, you can't. <laughs> um, and you can get all of Winnie the Pooh's favourite sort of food and and everything else on um, on the menu there. Um, it's a really nice uh, place to go. It's it's really interesting. Um, so it dates, the original building dates back to the 1700s. Um, really, really interesting. Um, so let me know.
Um, sorry, yeah, so let me know uh, what you think about this, whether it's somewhere that you will go. Uh, are you excited by the coin? Um, I think when the coin comes out, I will actually take a trip over there myself. Um, so I've been there a few times. Um, so I may well go over there and, and do a little block video, um, etc. Um, yeah, it'd be interesting. So as so, I say, I'm quite excited by it. Um, it's, you know, it's good fun. Um, there's a little um, museum there, a focus on I.A. Milne and E.H. Shepherd. Um, so, it's, you know, for such a tiny little shop, it, it's really, really good fun. Um, I'd recommend it, definitely. And I say all of um, the Winnie the Pooh stories are based around Hartfield and um, East Sussex. Um, I don't think it's actually open just yet, was it? It did say somewhere on here when it was going to reopen. Um, but yeah, it's definitely, you know, I'd, I'd say uh, July 22nd. Oh, so today, actually. Um so, yeah, I, I'd highly recommend it for anybody that's going there. You see Tigger's Toy and Gift Shop, um, a tea room. Choose between two rooms for you to visit. Um, Piglet's Tea Room, uh, as well as the AA Meal and the H Shepherd Room. And then the Pooseum, um, free museum. So, again, you know, it's all free. Um, artwork and toys, books, etc. Um, been featured on the BBC, obviously. Um, for anybody that's interested to know whereabouts um, it is, I oh, know I didn't want contact us, I wanted to find us. Um, I say it's in Hat Hartfield, um, East Sussex. Uh, where do we say? Um, I'm trying to think of some of the bigger areas that people might know. Um, from me, Tunbridge Wells, it's probably 15 to 20 minutes. Um, not far from East Grinstead, um, or, or um, which again is not far from Crawley, Gatwick area. Um, so, so, you know, it's it's easily accessible for everybody, I think. Or you might just be interested in the coins themselves. Um, so maybe that's all you're interested in. Um, so yeah, as I say, let me know down below in the comments section what you think about this new um, series of coins that we're going to get. Obviously, these will be replacing the um, Beatrix Potter. Um, and I say I don't. I'm quite excited by it. I've got to be honest, um, and say I'm really quite looking forward to this. Um, so yeah, I think this is going to be a really nice set. What do you think? As I say, let us know down below. 